Welcome to the V Bulletin training video on setting up MySQL for V Bulletin with cPanel. Setting up a database in cPanel is very easy and only takes a few short minutes to create a database, username, and password to use for your V Bulletin software. A quick note not all web host cPanels will look the same. If you're having problems with following our guide, please contact your web host for more help. While getting ready to install the V Bulletin software, I'm sure you noticed that you need a MySQL database, username, and password. Since we're already logged into the cPanel for our web host, we're going to scroll down to the MySQL database section and click on it. On this new page, we're going to choose to create a database. Note that all databases with cPanel will have your cPanel username and an underscore before the name. We're going to call ours VB5 and click Create Database. Now go back and let's add a user. Scrolling down a bit further, we find the MySQL user section. We're going to add a user. We'll call it Walker A under dash V Bull. At this point, you can either enter your own password or use a generator. Secure passwords are important, so we'll use the generator. I suggest clicking on Advanced Options, then choose Numbers Only. Sometimes bad characters can cause problems. By clicking numbers, we can avoid that. Copy and paste the password to your config.php file or somewhere else safe where you can check it. Next, check the box that says I have copied this password in a safe place. Then click continue. Now that we've got a user and a database, our last step is to give their user permission to use its database. From the Add User to Database dropdown, make sure your user and the database name are correct and choose Add. Once the page is loaded, you should check the All Privileges box. Then you can make changes accordingly. Afterwards, we'll click Save and then we're all good to go. Now we've got our MySQL user, password, and database name. Thank you for choosing vBulletin 5 Connect.